Hey guys, what's going on? This is the GTA Wise Guy, and in this video, I'm going to be talking to you guys about the main protagonists from the Need for Speed story, and also what styles of play they best represent. So we see all the five lined up at the end of the trailer, and we they sort of represent those five ways to play, so I believe the first guy in the middle to be the tuner guy, which is Nakai-san. Now, Nakai-san is the guy behind RBD Porsche, for those of you that don't know, and they also, well, they talk about in the trailer, he is the guy to go to for tuning cars. He is, he, he done like, he spent like, it was like, his panels were a single brush stroke, spent it four hours to fit it, and they actually mentioned his name as well. But the knock I signed, every panel was a single brush stroke. But we can also see from his hair, skin tone, and clothing that it looks just like him, so I think that's a given that that's going to be him. And we can also see his RWD Porsche, which is green in real life, in the game, and it also says on his number plate, Anakai. Now the next guy I believe to be Vaughn Gittins Jr. Now I did previously think that this was Ken Block because of their similar silhouettes, so the, the cap and the overalls, they're both the sort of signature look that they both have. Now the Ford Mustang RTR Spec 5, that is his car. Now this is the car that we see in the trailer, and this is the car that him and his team built, and it is a, basically a spitting image. So I think it's a given that that is Vaughn Gittins Jr. And he is going to be the style guy, so the drifting guy to go to. Now I believe the next guy is going to be the speed guy, which is Magnus Walker. So Magnus Walker restores old sort of Porsches like 911s, Carreras, that sort of stuff. And he sort of the, make, keeps them all classic and that. Whereas Nakai-san, he's the sort of RWD, makes really wide body kits. He goes all out crazy on them. And uh, Magnus Walker is a little more subtle. So it's sort of catering for all of the car guys out there. And Magnus Walker is sort of the classic tuner, but he is also an adrenaline seeker. This is why I think he's going to be the speed guy. Because he always, I've seen some videos where he's blasting down LA streets at night. And uh, the car in the trailer, which which is blasting down the road, the grey one, he does actually own one like that in real life. So I believe that he is going to be the speed guide, the adrenaline seeker that you guys are going to be interacting with in the story mode. Now the next guy is Kai Mirai-san, and this is the guy behind TRA Kyoto. And he is the guy who makes rocket bunny kits for BRZs, 180SXs and all that sort of stuff. But I do believe that he's going to be the outlaw guy, because he is renowned as an outlaw kanjo racer in the Osaka Underground as well. And he does actually own his own sort of Datsun that's very styled, similar to the 2000 GT that we see in the trailer of running from the cops. So that white with the black flared arches as well. And finally, I believe the crew guys are going to be the Risky Devils. So we see one silhouette that I believe that's probably going to be like Richard Fisher or something, the leader of the crew, I believe. They are driving BRZs or kitted out with rocket bunnies. And they are the underground street racing guys in Chicago. So they are all represented from real world icons that are actually out there in the car scene. So there we are guys, I believe that that is all of the guys that we are going to see in the story and all the styles that they represent as well. So we'll just take a look back now at the trailer to see how they're shown. So there's Vaughn Gittins Jr. in his RTR Mustang Drifting, he's the style guy, the tuner guy Nakai-san in his Porsche blasting by, Magnus Walker blasting down the streets as the Speed King, and we've also got Kamurai san running from the cops in his 2000 GT, the Risky Devils all running down as the crew. So we can see how they're all represented and I believe that what I've got here is correct and that is all the guys that we're going to see. But obviously we might know differently because I'm sure Need for Speed are going to announce it soon who all of the characters are anyway. So anyway guys that is pretty much all for this video. I'd like to say thank you for 50,000 subscribers. That is just crazy. I never thought I'd have that much so soon. And we have refreshed 6 star now so if you want to apply make sure to check out the previous promo video which is going to be linked at the end of the video as well. And you guys can apply. And we're going to be setting up a blog so you guys can track your ranks and everything. And I hope you guys will join in on the journey. We'll be streaming some meets and we'll be doing loads of meets on PC and hopefully PS4 sometime soon as well. Anyway guys, that is pretty much all for this video. Thanks for watching and I hope to see you in the next one.